Hey guys, so sorry for the really bad shadows and stuff, but I've I think I found the perfect setting for tutorials now. So yeah, I'm going to show you how to make this orange juice charm. This is the stuff you'll be needing. For the tools you'll be needing, an exacto knife, wire cutters if you want to make it into a charm, pin. It's optional, but you can use a blending tool. So that is what you'll be needing. Okay, so first you want to take your two balls of the coloured clay of your own choice. I'm using red and yellow, as you saw in the pictures. And you both want to roll them into a coil. They need to be about the same width. So now you've got your two coils, you want to put them together and then sort of twist it, roll it so the surface is smooth. If you want you can bake it before but I'm just going to save electricity. So you just want to cut them into small pieces like that. You're going to get a lot of these but they're nice for future projects. Um, so yeah, so these are going to be your straws and I'll just put them to the side because you don't really need that many. Now you've got your one straw, you can put that to the side and we're now going to make the actual orange juice glass. Do you want to take some of your orange clay? want to roll it into a tapered log shape so it looks a bit like a glass. You should get something like this. So now you want to put that to the side and we shall now do the actual glass part. Now take your translucent clay, roll it into a ball and then flatten it and you can use your exacto knife to just roll it, cut your sheet of translucent clay so it fits the width of this glass. So you can place it on and then just cut the sides like that and I'm just going to cut the rough edges as well. Just roll the translucent clay with the glass, cut that excess clay off to roll it so it looks a bit more natural, like this. Some of your leftover translucent clay and just roll it into a ball. Then you want to flatten it so it fits the bottom of the glass. And then you just want to roll it so it's blended in. And if you want, you can use your blending tool and blend it like that. So now you want to take your black clay and roll it into a coil again. Take the thinnest part of your coil, for me it's the end, and then you just want to put it on to the glass and use your exacto knife to kind of shape it into a smiley face. I have this but you can make your smile longer and then cut two more things of the coil and roll them into balls to create the eye. Then you can just stick them on to the glass. And 
there's your glass. Now you want to get your straw back and then kind of attach it. You may want to trim it if it looks a bit too long. Get your eye pin and use your wire cutters to just trim it down. Stick it in the charm. Have your orange juice charm. So thank you for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I think this setup is the best setup I've done for my tutorials. So I really hope you enjoyed it and yeah, see you in the next video. Bye!